Hi guys, welcome to the Ahmad Logs channel. In this video, I will show you how to control relay module using ESP32 and Google Sheets. This technique is not as efficient as other IoT platforms such as Blink IoT or Arduino IoT. It takes 5 to 6 seconds to perform a command, but it is unique idea to control home appliances using Google Sheet for free. To turn on the relay, enter relay number along with the command on. Then ESP32 read the command and turn on the relay. This whole process takes 5 to 6 seconds to complete. Also, you can see the status of the relay will be updated in real time. Similarly, to turn off the relay, enter relay number along with the command off. And the relay will be turned off. Let's see how I made this project. Let's get started. For this project, you will need an ESP32 board, 4 channel relay module. 220 volts AC bulbs. So let's do the connection. Connect all the components as per circuit diagram. Next step is to create a Google Sheet. For that, go to Google Drive. And then, create a Google Sheet. The sheet is created. Here is a one cell. And we will use this cell to send commands to control the relays. Next, create labels for each relay as relay 1, relay 2, relay 3 and relay 4. And the initial state of each relay will be off. Now, go to script editor, by clicking on tools menu, and then click on script editor. Here, we will enter the code, to communicate with ESP32. Copy the code from my GitHub account. I will share the link in video description. And then, in the script editor, paste the code that we have copied. And then, here, enter the Google Sheet ID. You can get it from your sheet URL. Here, I have highlighted the sheet ID. Just copy it, and go back to script editor. And, paste the sheet ID. Then press Ctrl plus S to save the script. Next, deploy the script by click on New Deployment. Then select Web App. And then, Allow access to everyone. Then click on deploy. Next, authorize access. Select your email. Click on advance. Then click on go to the project unsafe. And then allow. Here is the deployment ID which we'll use in the code. So, copy the deployment ID by clicking here. And then go to ESP32 sketch. I will share the link in the video description. Paste the deployment ID here. Enter your Wi-Fi SSID and password. That's it. Then connect the ESP32 to your computer. And then upload the code. Let's understand the working of the code. Here is the ESP32 read Google Sheet function. And, this function will send read request to Google Sheet script. Then the script will get the command from a one cell. And then, script will send back the command to ESP32. And then, the command will be stored in payload variable. And below, I am passing the command to relay control function. This function will turn on or off the relay according to the command. And then, this line of code will send back the response to Google script. And the state of the relay will be updated in the Google Sheet. This is for today. If you have any question, then comment below. See you in another video. Bye.